What's up everybody? This is Jeremy Clark and I'm here with another wine review. So let's talk about Black Girl Magic. Is there anything better? Well let's see if there's magic in this wine bottle by the McBride sisters. By ending this video, you'll know exactly what this wine tastes like and what foods you can pair it with. So let's get into it. For the best motivational lifestyle and wine advice, subscribe to my channel and hit the bell to be notified when I post a new video. So I first stumbled upon this wine uh, when I was shopping for rosés at my local wine shop. Um, and immediately uh, when I saw the bottle, um, I was intrigued. Uh, what caught my eye first was the presentation, to be honest. Uh, the black and gold on top of the, obviously the rosé color of the wine itself was a great compliment. And it looked rich and luxurious, so I wanted to try it out. And when I did, I loved it. So now I'm going to get into review so I can share with you uh, why I loved it so much and you'll know exactly what it tastes like. Okay, let's see if there's some magic in this rosé. So, this is a Pinot Noir variety rosé um, and from the first look of it if you can see um, it's a nice translucent pink color uh, it looks a lot like a grapefruit uh, so let's give it a little swirl and you know in my previous video I let you guys know swirling the wine opens it up allows for oxygen to get in the wine and you know let the aromas really come out so you can uh, get the full effect of the uh, flavors within the wine um, so the aromas I'm getting from this wine, immediately what I get is a strong zesty uh, aroma from this wine. So it's a lot of, uh, I smell a lot of like citrus, like grapefruit, um, and some, a little bit of lemon as well. And let's see what this baby tastes like. There is some magic in this wine right here. So this is a light and crisp wine. You know what I'm saying? It's not too sweet. That is a dry wine. Um, this wine does contain flavors of strawberries, raspberries, um, and you can definitely taste the citrus fruits in this wine as well. Um, now we're gonna definitely start getting into the pairings that what you, what goes best with this wine, so that we can you know. Choose this wine for the right type of days. Comment below and tell me which wines that you enjoy and you would like for me to review next. So as far as pairings go, uh, this is a light wine. So you want to pair with other light foods. So you're looking at foods like a salad or a light pasta or a nice salmon, you know, with other seafood as well. Pro tip, this wine is especially good when it's a nice hot day outside and you're having brunch with your friends. It's light, it's crisp, and a 13% alcohol volume that's contained within the wine uh, is guaranteed to get you in the mood. This wine is also great if you want to just relax and read a book. I highly suggest you guys get my book, Did You Know You Are The Shit, that effectively explains how to use positive affirmations to overcome self-doubt, think positively, and is a journal to document your progress along the way. This book is available on Amazon now. The link is in my description below. If you like this video, be sure to hit that like button, subscribe to my channel, and share with your friends.